Start your answers, doctor. Daily we will have 20 to 30 image based MCQ quiz to energize you, activate you. Yesterday's quiz we have uh, uploaded into the YouTube channel. So, <clears throat> we are all, we are not doing any noble work, doctor. It is a commercial tactic to tell you that we give a quality coaching program. So, please join and enroll for our uh, subscription in the online mbbs.com for the top need PG in 120 days program, right? So, I'll be very happy to see you joining every day and giving me a feedback how you are feeling improvement day by day, 120 days you should spend. So, Argha Saha, Aizaz, Ahmadwani are all proposing 1B. So, what is this machine first of all? Lithotripsy, extracorporeal lithotripsy. So, of all doctor, it is the cysteine stones which are highly resistant is what you need to remember. Very good. Which are the following cancer? rarely leads to this CT appearance. This is the CT appearance. Which cancer rarely leads to this CT, CT scan appearance is a very important question. Yes. Should be a confident answer. Question number two. Keep punching your answers, doctor. Chandrakant Haider proposes D, melanoma. Ritu says prostrate. Satya says melanoma. What is your answer? So, it is prostrate, doctor. One big claps to Ritu Raj for a correct answer. Very good. Which is the oncogene which is not implicated in this thyroid cancer? What is this histology of the thyroid cancer? Then, just knowing that is not enough. You should also know what are the enzymes which are involved. Yes. Please shoot your answer. So, this is the quiz link, doctor. Everyday quiz has got a link where you can be able to share it with you, all your friends. Yes. Papillary. Excellent. And Ritu is proposing RAS. And uh, Asban Sheikh is proposing BRAF. Veerappan, Madhu, everyone is strong about BRAF. So, it is the P53. Otherwise, RAS, red to BRAF, they are all there in the papillary carcinoma of the thyroid. The condition shown in the figure, it becomes operated if it is greater than what size? So, what is the condition shown in the CT scan? What is your diagnosis? And beyond what size do you like to operate that? Yes. So, Agha Saha. Argha Saha. Okay. Argha Saha. Sudha Shukla. Saptarshi Das. Everyone is proposing 5.5. Absolutely right. 5.5. It is an aortic aneurysm. Lot of times elderly people who have atherosclerosis, they will, you have, for some reason, if you happen to do ultrasound in elderly person, it is not unlikely to find a aortic aneurysm in elderly person because they will have atherosclerosis that will weaken the wall. But all of them will not be operated unless the size is more than 5.5 centimeters. A red flag in motor development is which one among these? If this child which is being shown in the picture is not able to perform. So you should know based on what this child is doing, what is her possible age and for that age what is the motor sign which is uh, Possibly uh, a red flag sign. 
tricky thing. अगर ये मालूम नहीं है तो happy. Because there are two things you should know. You should diagnose this child age based on what she is doing. हाँ. First of all, tell me what is the possible age of the child. Shilpa says cannot draw circle. Madhu says cannot draw circle. What is your answer, doctor? Huh? You want to say, what is the age you think? Age couple, huh? Super! Lawrence Jindabad. Lawrence Jindabad. So, there are Lawrence up projection they know. He is our national celebrity coming to the class. Because of you only, Lawrence, I am coming every day to the class. Let me tell you. Right? I am otherwise uh, not this much a committed guy. Suddenly, if I feel in the evening, uh, let's skip the class today, I will remember Lawrence. Oh, at least for Lawrence, let me go to the class. Right? And so many online students who are spending their valuable time with us in the evening. Yeah? Right. So, what is your answer? Three years is absolutely right. If he cannot hold a spoon, that is abnormal. Sam Singh only correctly answered. Right? Huh. So you should remember alternate feet going up the stairs. With alternate feet going up the stairs is two and a half to three years is what you need to basically remember. A young girl presented with frequent dropping of the objects in the morning. No postictal state. And the EEG has been shown to you. Gor se deko. EEG ko. Aur batao. EEG. So what is the uh, diagnosis? What is your diagnosis? Young girl with frequent dropping attacks. Arga Saha is proposing absence seizures. Mujhe malum hai. Frequent dropping of objects, not drop attacks. Sayeda Shabas clean bowl. Roshan Yadav clean bowl. Amruta Francis. <laughs> Jindavan. Juvenile myoclonic epilepsy doctor. And these are basically called bilateral 4 to 6 hertz polyspike waves. Which you see in case of the juvenile myoclonic epilepsy now this is the tocogram identify the problem in the trace right so one is the fetal heart rate another is the myometrial force right so what is this uh, uh, typically do you like to call this as early deceleration, poor variability, normal trace or a sinusoidal pattern? What do you like to call? Identify the problem in the trace. Very good. We have Dr. B.R. Verma. Question number 7. 7 ka answer batana. Verma ji. Yes. What is the answer for 7? Shilpa Reddy thinks C. Verma ji bol rahe. Sinusoidal pattern. Shilpa thinks it is normal. Chandrakant Haider. <laughs> Superb. What is your answer, Lawrence? There is a video lecture on completely uh, in our 120 day program in obstetrics. One of that is uh, um, fetal uh, well being monitoring. Please review that. Right? So, uh, you should. All spent five hours. Lagatar dil lagake time dena. Five hours and review eight to nine lectures which are there in the plan given to you. So we have discussed a lot about this tocographic pattern. This is early deceleration, Dr. Chandrakan Jindaban. Now, procedure with the following instrument can be done for all this except. So, pehla ye instrument kya hai? Backpiper hai kya? Ah, what is this instrument? So, procedure with the following instrument can be used for all the following except. Question number 8. Huh? Hystero? Hystroscopy? 
हिस्ट्रेक्टमी हा ओके हा बी आर वर्मा ऑल्सो बताया कि क्वेश्चन नंबर एट 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 मधुश्री से सर यू कैन डू हिस्ट्रेक्ट मी विथ हिस्ट्रोस्कोप इजिएस्ट क्वेश्चन राइट सो मायोमेक्टमी सेप्टम रिमूवल पॉलिप रिमूवल एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा कैन बी डन वेरी गुड सो दिस इज हाउ द हिस्ट्रोस्कोपी इज बींग पास एंड यू विल बी एबल टू विजुअलाइज द यूट्रेस सो यू हैव यूट्रेस यू हैव ए ब्लैडर रेक्टम नाउ आइडेंटिफाई दिस इंस्ट्रूमेंट आइडेंटिफाई दिस इंस्ट्रूमेंट so every day morning uh, we are starting uh, staff nurse training exam uh, coaching there are 15 subjects for the staff nurses huge demand huge requirement also lot of my own friends who have nursing home says are anna medical surgical nursing and all this jara revision karo concepts if not the staff nurse exam they will get the seat in uh, they will get knowledge enough to handle patients my only worry is shall i run this on the same youtube channel or uh, uh, suddenly another 1 lakh uh, nurses will come and uh, become subscribers huge number if i run on this only but i am just thinking uh, sometimes notifications will keep coming to you but uh, what i found is a lot of nursing uh, uh i'm just preparing for those uh, classes lot of that stuff is supposed to be known by us also right we ourselves will not be very sure of that stuff so what is your suggestion doctor same channel shall we run the nursing uh, uh tutorials please give your feedback another 1 lakh nurses will come and sit and they will also start attending our evening uh, md classes also huh? so you will have competition with the nurses then <laughs> in answering the questions so doctor we should remember it is episiotomy scissors saptarshi sayada vishalakshi everyone correctly answered right so please give me a feedback shall i make nurse training on a different uh, there are uh, 15 subjects medical surgical nursing community nursing almost what we study right not to that depth but uh, they need to have a lot of working knowledge so shall we run it on the same channel or a different channel every day morning 10 to 1 is going to be their class so a 20 year old girl presents to the clinic with primary amenorrhea she has a female phenotype height is 150 cm poorly developed breast breast is poorly developed vagina was present ultrasound revealed normal uterus but gonads are not detected further evaluation was done and this is her karyotype right satya says sir different channel let's keep nurse business different md business different okay satya is telling means we have to agree with satya ha so what what is others opinion yeah only problem is if they click on the bell sign even those classes when they start you get a notification there's only coincidence yes uh what is your answer doctor this is the karyotype female phenotype height 150 vagina is there uterus is there but ovaries and other gonads are not there kavya najneen also say sir nurses different and we different okay saptarshi proposes uh ah uh, you have to give one of the options sorry is it androgen insensitivity nunan true hermaphrodite swier which one do you like to call it as which one do you like to call it as yes doc shilpa proposes androgen insensitivity syndrome okay sam singh proposes swier roshan amrita vanaparthi vanishri very good after a long time i am seeing rocket trader rocket trader bahut dinon ke baad mile hum bahut khush hai ha so last october november december just like nowadays i do bhajan of uh, amrita amrita we are doing bhajan of rocket trader he used to be every day regular student i is asked what is your answer doctor swier syndrome doctor all the people who said d satya everyone is right so you should remember it is a xy karyotype then uh, important thing is vagina is not ending like a blind pouch 
that is the situation androgen insensitivity syndrome and uh, typically there is a normal uterus uterus kahan hota nahi hota usme androgen insensitivity mein that is the fundamental uh, difference very good rocket trader already joined uh, ms that's good so some of you also will sometime will come and uh, catch up with the old teacher and say sir i joined dm i joined mch i joined uh, md that is a very good uh, happy news rocket trader uh, after a long time which college where you joined ms so october november december january rocket trader used to be a very like a missiles he used to give the answers i am so happy he joined ms right dog all of you will also join only thing is you need to spend time every day and go back to online mbbs dot com and uh, do the revision so that is a swayer doctor identify this condition you have to identify this condition so what is this condition <coughs> question number 11 very good rocket tra trader joined gujarat in ms university um arga saha is proposing a a yes uh yeah what are your other answers doctor varma saab bol rahe ye bittu shukla is proposing a but madhu is right very good madhu ranjit ranjan also right twin twin transfusion syndrome what is the most common treatment modality for this fracture so what is this fracture what is the most common way that you want to treat this fracture question number 12 what is your answer yes doctor nivedita basuraju is proposing very good to see 70 online students vanaparthi vanishri is proposing plating samsung is thinking uh, uh tbw means wiring right ha huh. so tbw is the treatment for this doctor for a comminuted fracture is what you need to remember tension band wiring right ha huh. that's good what is the most likely fracture causing this deformity right uh tension band wiring correct so what is the most likely <coughs> fracture causing this deformity fatafat bolo satya snigdha is proposing rituraj roshan amrita everyone is saying gun stock deformity which is seen in suprakondylar fracture of the humerus okay doc so this is the gun stock deformity most common cause of this deformity kya hota hai look at the deformity make up your mind what is a uh, what are all the abnormalities that you are seeing so this is called wind swept deformity here also costochondral junctions you are finding thickening so based on this what is your diagnosis doctor question number 14 yes should your answer most common cause of this deformity kya ho sakta hai vanaparthi vanishri is proposing b suhani patak also saying rickets that's right that's right so uh, that is what you need to remember now a 60 year old female complains of bilateral knee pain associated with the pain in the small joints of the hand with this deformity what do you like to call the diagnosis what is your diagnosis yes should you answer doctor very good to see 75 online students shortly we are going to touch 100 for our daily 6 to 8 class right uh so please tell your classmates paste this link in the 
youtube uh, whatsapp telegram wherever the groups you are in yes so nazia hassan is proposing rheumatoid arthritis vanaparthi vani sri also that's right absolutely right rheumatoid arthritis a 55 year old male complains of urinary incontinence severe back pain for 10 days no history of weight loss and fever imaging is being shown mri is being shown to you i should have removed the arrow but still arrow is also there real exam mein arrow nahi dete examiner so tell all your friends that every day 20 image based requests and a two hours of high yield topic discussion will be there and um, also please subscribe to online mbbs.com so that we keep sending you the emails to you and um, you can call our helpline in order to get the best price to subscribe yes so doctor this is a case of lumbar disc prolapse leading to the compression of the cauda equina so this is a cauda equina syndrome where there is urinary incontinence severe back pain is what you need to remember but since there is no weight loss you should rule out possibility of multiple myeloma because there is no fever unlikely to be pots by not gulen berry that's the point now doc a 55 year old female presented with this clinical presentation this is the attitude <coughs> of the patient so you should identify looking at this clinical pic as to what is the um abnormality and uh, which is the test to use it to detect this quick you like to call ln test trendlenburg thomas ober yes should you answer doctor 55 year old the female presented with the following clinical presentation yes so samsung proposes trendlenburg roshan yadav thinks ln ln is for the insufficiency of uh, the circulation no virappan proposes thomas absolutely virappan wins vanaparthi vanishri also right thomas whenever there is a flexion contracture of hip knee and ankle like this flexion contracture of the hip is tested by using the thomas test now doc that brings us to the end of the story so thanks for a patient listening giving your time in the evening once more tomorrow evening 6 o'clock we will all catch up and uh, enjoy a great day another 5 to 6 months wonderful time every day we study we are sure to get the seat there is no other way to get the seat but only this right so thank you very much